Yo guys, what's up? This is Week K. I'm filming this video because I recently came across, recently, a couple of days actually, a couple of days ago, I came across a plan, a certain illustrious diet plan that's called the whiskey diet. Now, I know how it sounds. I exactly know how it sounds, but I came across this and it made me think, man, what on earth was this guy thinking when he actually uploaded this video? It's called the whiskey diet. And he claims that you lose weight if you follow his diet plan. I say, man, that's bullshit. Exactly how I came across this thing is uh, just a couple, of, a couple of days back, I met an acquaintance of mine. Now, we used to work out uh, in the same gym previously. And um, it had been like four or five years. I had not seen the guy. I had not seen the guy. All of a sudden, I was just riding back home. I heard someone scream my name. So I stopped and looked, looked around. And uh, what I see is this guy from across the street approaching me. Uh, well, at first, I didn't recognize the guy because uh, he was never lean actually. He was overweight. But uh, this time, I saw a very fat guy walking towards me. So it was, I didn't recognize him at first, but eventually when he got close, then I recognized and I remembered this guy. So uh, we, did, uh, we did the meet and greet part, and then eventually the uh, conversation went down to fitness. And uh, he started telling me that he was very frustrated because he had gained so, many, so much weight and uh, uh, because for some reason he didn't work out for three years. He had been working in Bangalore and uh, he didn't work out at all for three years. Okay, so this guy has gained at least 20 to 25 kilo from what I, uh, what I had seen him the last time. Uh, anyway, so he told me that he was recently back, like three months back he shifted back to the city and he joined the gym. Uh, at first, uh, the first month he wasn't very regular. Uh, but for last two months he had been working out really hard and he had been on a clean diet and he lost 7 kg. He told me that he weighed 138 kg earlier and then after this hard work, regular hard work and uh, clean diet, he got down to 131. I said that was good man. I mean come on. If you lose 7 kg in two months you're doing a great job. He, uh, but then this guy said no, he was not satisfied actually. He was, he was disappointed. He had set the bar at 12 kg in two months, and if not 12, minimum 10 was the goal. And uh, now what happens is, uh, he tells me now that uh, at times he uh, got so frustrated that he felt like he, you know not working out at all because he wasn't getting the desired results. So instead, someone, uh, some of us. Uh, of his colleagues from Bangalore told him that he had seen a video called the Whiskey Diet. So uh, this guy watched the video and started the uh, started working on the plan. Now uh, uh, again, this guy told me I am not going to take his name, so we are going to call him Sunny. So now Sunny told me that he had been following this diet for six seven days and he had lost about two point five to three kg. I was like, man. Uh, uh, I don't know what to say, but yeah, uh, we had a bit of chat and then I came back home. I was curious. I was actually curious. So I came back home and I watched the video. Now what do I see? What I see is this guy, I don't know his name. So we're going to call him Moron. So this Moron has uploaded a video claiming that he lost 49 pounds. Right? 49 pounds. The story is that uh, this guy, the, the guy who uploaded the video, he was celebrating his 49th birthday and then he took a birthday resolution and uh, decided that he will lose 50 pounds till the next birthday. So in this span of one year, he's going to lose 50 pounds. So he started the whiskey diet. Now, now he claims that he lost the weight, but I don't believe you. I don't believe him because there is no before or after photos. It's nothing practical. He's just typed it in fonts and he's just written it. Now what does he say? The advantages of the whiskey diet. 
Now more, what does he tell you to do? He tells you not to eat anything throughout the day. The first meal that you'll have, like the first uh, meal is going to be in the evening or the dinner. That's the only meal you're allowed. Now, what does he tell you to do? He tells you to drink whiskey throughout the day. Let me get this right. You're not allowed to eat, but you're allowed to drink whiskey. Now, what's the logic? I don't get a logic. If someone can please tell me the logic, I'd be very happy. What does it do? Why drink whiskey? Whiskey has calories. You better go buy some, uh, some Domino's pizza or KFC burger, man. Because, yes, that is going to have calories, but it has carbs, protein, fat. It has something that, that will do good to your body. It's junk food, but it's still good. If you're drinking whiskey, what are you doing? You are taking empty calories. That's right, empty calories. The whiskey doesn't have protein, carb, or fat. It doesn't have anything. It's zero. The only thing you're consuming is calories, plain calories. Now, the advantages, uh, uh, according to this guy, the advantages of uh, being on the diet. Number one, enhanced alcoholic pleasure. Enhanced alcoholic experience. Yes, of course, you're going to have it because you're drinking on an empty stomach. Right. Number two, that drinking whiskey takes care of the social anxiety. Now, social anxiety? Sunny, man, do you want to be taking advice from a guy who, who's, who walks out of the house and he's nervous, he's anxious? He can't mingle with people when he's sober, so he has to drink whiskey to be comfortable among them. Hmm? So, a couple of advantages of uh, the whiskey diet. And then, again he tells you one more thing, takes you to another level, and he tells you not to overdo it. Because one fine day, he overdid it, he was at a party, he drank, he drank a little too much, and he ended up in a hospital. And <laughs> come on man, you actually have posted a video that says by following your own whiskey diet, you ended up in a hospital. And yet desperate people who need guidance are following it. I at least know one person who's following it, this guy Sunny. Sunny man, you are sound up here. You're just a little desperate. And that's not a problem. I know it gets tough. I was overweight. I, I, know, I know it gets tough. You start losing hope. But that's, you know, you just have to stick to it. Just have to keep doing what you're doing. And the results will come. Now, uh, this guy Sunny was telling me that he's getting married in the next six months and he wants to uh, look good on his wedding. Man, six months is good time. Seriously, you can do wonders with that time if you work hard. If you are consistent, if you are going to the gym regularly, eat, you know, eating clean, you are on a clean diet and you are hard working. You will achieve man, 6 months, if you are regular to the gym, you will look awesome. I guarantee that. I personally guarantee that. You just have to be regular. You just have to be consistent and sincere. No, no one can stop you from looking good on your wedding man. I promise you that. So. What I'm going to advise you to do is get off this moronic whiskey diet plan, go to the gym, hit the gym hard, eat clean, and I'm telling you, you will look good on your wedding man. That's what you want to do. Don't do stupid stuff. And there is so much of misleading and uh, misguiding information floating on the internet, man. It makes me crazy sometimes. Uh, but anyway, this is my advice to you, man. Stick to the gym. Uh, you know the money you're spending on the whiskey take it instead get a good gym membership eat clean eat good and you will definitely look good so this is what I've got to say to you Sonny keep it up just go to the gym and uh, about one more thing now I'm going to be starting a uh, YouTube channel it's going to be called the lifestyle club in this on this channel I'm going to post videos uh, sharing the information, sharing my knowledge uh, and the experience through the years of training 
and styling and grooming. I'm going to share my uh, knowledge with you guys. Just listen to people who are saying, man, this guy must have been drunk actually when he uploaded the video. So listen to people who are at least sober, saying. That's it. That's it from me. And uh, stay tuned for more videos. There are lots more videos coming your way. So this is VK signing off from the Lifestyle Club. Ciao.